Hi guys, you might have heard about a place called Tanzania in Africa. Towering mountains, tangled acacia, and red robe massey striding across the sweeping savanna. Tanzania is a country of contrast. Thanks to a growing range of sustainable travel options, this classic safari country is more accessible than ever. In this video, let's look at some of the national parks that you can take a safari ride in Tanzania. So let's get it on. Tarangir National Park Hop into a four-wheel drive and get lost among the colossal baobabs of Tarangi National Park. This reserve in northern Tanzania is the sixth largest national park in the country and is one of the best places to see migrating elephants, especially during the dry season. You will also spot plenty of buffalo and giraffe at this time of year as well as the predators that follow. Wildlife is a bit more scattered, so you may have to go searching, but that makes good sightings even more special. If you are lucky, you might spot a fringe-eared oryx or jaranak, which you won't find anywhere else in Tanzania. Serengeti National Park As the crown jewel of Tanzania's national parks, the Serengeti is home to the world-famous wild beast migration. Witness Africa's greatest spectacle when more than one million of these ungainly unglades gather in search of fresh gazing. The migration is fairly predictable and the herds can be found in different parts of the Serengeti throughout the year. The park's cheetahs are habituated to the presence of tourists and may even nap in the shade of your car. However, remember your safari etiquette and don't attempt to interact with the animals. Arusha National Park Not all of Tanzania's best wildlife destinations require you to head deep into the bush. Arusha National Park is about an hour's drive from Kilimanjaro International Airport. Like neighboring Kenya's Nairobi National Park, this reserve is home to a surprising variety of fauna. While you can opt for a traditional 4x4 safari here, another great option is to take a guided walk. You can spot elephant, black and white Columbus monkeys, and if you have a few days to spare, you can even conquer the grilling trek to the summit of Mount Meru. While the migration is an incredible sight, it also attracts plenty of travelers during the peak season of June through October. If you want to avoid the crowds, consider a camping safari away from the chaos. Camping represents a more sustainable safari. Your accommodation will be more basic, but you will be even closer to nature. Nothing beats the sound of a hyena cackling or a lion roaring just outside the canvas wall of your tent. Hope you guys liked the video. Do comment your thoughts in the comment section and make sure to subscribe to the channel as it helps a lot.